Well, how about a little playoff preview this first weekend in December as the Vikings are here in Atlanta to take on the Falcons. This is a good one. It's the NFL on Fox 9 and 2 Minnesota against 7 and 4 Atlanta. As we say hello and welcome you to the broadcast booth. My partner is Charles Davis and I'm Kevin Burkhardt. So for the Vikings, Charles, I don't know, the last four or five years, you always think about defense and rightfully so. But I don't think many people realize they are a top five offensive team in the league right now. And they're led by their quarterback, one Case Keenum, wow. who's playing as well as any quarterback in the league right now. And that's what the Atlanta staff says when they watch the tape. They're running the football well with Latavius Murray. But their head coach, Mike Zimmer, he worries about the ball hawking defense of Atlanta. He wants his team to sustain drives in the running game, get extra yards after contact, and in the passing game, yards after the catch. Yeah, Atlanta does not let up a lot of big plays. We'll see how that translates today against the Falcons, who are picking up steam. They've won three in a row. And even though we know they passed the ball all over the place, we were stressed on Friday at their facility. It's all about the run. It certainly is. And let's face it, Tevin Coleman has done very well during the time that Devontae Freeman has been out. But guess what? Devontae Freeman's back. Right. So their two-headed monster is in effect. They love these two running the football, but they also believe that they have an advantage in the passing game with them as well. Isolate them on those excellent Minnesota linebackers, as well as their all-world safety, Harrison Smith. Yeah, it should be a heck of a matchup here today. The Vikings have won seven in a row. The Falcons have won three in a row. Two hot teams, playoff bound. Kickoff coming up next on Fox.